just I was just about to get ready to go to the gym and I received a parcel from Cotton On. I'm so excited that I need to try it on now before I go to the gym because I don't know if I'm the only one, but I need to try my stuff before I go to the gym because uh, I can't wait till tomorrow. This is outfit number one. I really like this outfit. The pockets in here as well. Oh my god, I got the same one in black. Thank god. Because this is so nice. I think I'll have two now. Oh, this is a little running there. Thank god. Let's try it on. Ooh. See what else we've got. Wow. Oh, this is so nice. This is giving like skims vibes. Ooh, I like this. Oh, the fit of this is really nice. Like a little oversized jumper. Oh, the hood is really nice. In the back. Anyway, it's time to get ready for gym because I don't want to be late. So I just got home um, and I just made some food. It is currently 10.45 p.m. and I want to remind you that although it's this late, you can still eat. And what I'm having is a stew with chicken, potato and vegetables. And then for dessert, I'm having literally a rice cake. The thing is, food is fuel and changing my mindset that has helped me so much because I used to see it as just calories and I used to think the less I eat, the better, but you need to nourish your body. And if it's hungry, you need to honor that. I was at work until now and I'm hungry, so I'm gonna eat. I'm not gonna just ignore my hunger and go to bed starving. I mean, that's what I used to be doing, but now, I'm not afraid to be eating at 10.45 because it doesn't mean you're going to gain weight if you eat this late. Anyway, I just wanted to give you a little note on that. I'm going to go and enjoy this and then go to sleep and I'll catch you tomorrow. Good morning guys. Today we listen to our body and we work up a bit later. We work up at 7.30. Yeah, I wanted to work up at 6.30, but sometimes if you can't go to sleep at night, it's actually worth to sleep a bit more. And I've made my ginger and turmeric tea. The first thing I have on the empty stomach, and then I have breakfast within one hour. First off, we're gonna drink this, get some work started, and then in like half an hour we'll have some breakfast. It's time to make breakfast slash my pre-workout meal. So I always, always, always have oats as a pre-workout meal. Like I've been doing this for like six years now. The reason why your protein porridge is not nice is because you're not making your protein powder right. But I just add a dash of water and then I make it into a paste, like quite a thick paste. So yeah, like this is the paste and now we're just gonna throw it on top of the oats. Hits the spot every single time. So guys, I added some raspberries and dark chocolate because dark chocolate is actually very, very good for you. It's high in magnesium and also raspberries for fiber and antioxidants. And then I have my little decaf coffee. Mm. Really, I, like, I love this meal. And when you love what you eat, it's so easy to eat healthy. I'm gonna eat this and then head off to the gym. So I'll see you there.
So I just did my training session, it was upper body. I wasn't really feeling it to be honest, I felt quite weak, uh, but it's fine, we got it done. And I did a tiny bit of cardio just to finish, and then I did it at the beginning too. I did 10 minutes and then 10 minutes of stair master at the end, because I find that that way you can split it up. Um, now we're off to get some food because I am starving, so we're gonna go home, and I'll catch you then. Ha <laughs> ha! Hey guys, so I'm back home and I got a delivery and I thought I'd open it with you guys, as you can tell. I love online shopping because I had one yesterday too. I'm um, trying to get into running a bit and I've got my running shoes from Nike. Oh, oh, oh wow, they're pretty. They're very bright. So I've got some running trainers from Nike and I've got another couple pairs coming tomorrow. Just because I'm trying to find the right shoe for me. Uh, but this one's so cute. Let's try it on. They're so pretty. These are the Nike Zoom Fly 5. Wow! <laughs> Good morning guys. My body is feeling stiff and I was planning on doing a run today because I was really excited I got my new shoes but that might have to be hold off because I feel quite weak today and just tired. You know when you wake up and you have like no power in your hands. So what I wanted to do is remind you guys that you need to listen to your body because your body's going to tell you what's right and what's wrong. Especially as females, our hormones change every day and we need to honour that and we need to listen to them because when you start pushing yourself too much, that's when you cause hormonal imbalances. And yeah, like trust me, I've been on the end where I was like extreme dieting, extreme exercising and it didn't turn out well for me. So honestly, the best thing you can do for yourself is just have that balanced and healthy life. Right guys, so we are back home now and before breakfast, I wanna make some ginger, lemon and turmeric shots. So I'm gonna show you how I do that. First thing you wanna be doing, you wanna cut up your ginger, you wanna cut up your lemon into like two pieces and then you want your turmeric powder with water. So I'm gonna add until the max really. Into a blender now, I added two teaspoons of turmeric powder then I added the lemon and the ginger I just cut and also a tiny bit of black pepper because it helps you absorb the shot better. And now we're gonna blend this up. Out for a little drainer. Good morning guys, welcome to day four. So yesterday was a rest day. I didn't do anything apart from just doing some work, doing some content and literally that was it. And then today we are training. I am hoping to go on a run because my shoes came and we're gonna do a little try on hold again. I also wanna train with weights. So we're gonna do both of those today, but let's try on the shoes. These are here, let's open them up. I'll definitely say if you're like me and you're like trying to go through shoes, go to a shop and just try them on and buy them then because I've literally been waiting for deliveries all week and haven't gone on any runs. A Clifton 9s, Coca Clifton 8s. Okay, these are cute ish. I know that you shouldn't be looking at fashion with shoes, but I kind of want it to look cute, you know. These are the three different types of shoes. I'm gonna give them all a go and then let you know which one I'm keeping. All right, guys, so out of all of these, so the Hoka 9s, the Nike Zoom Fly 5s, the Hoka 8s are the winners. And they feel the most comfortable. I got the wide ones up to size 7. I am a size 6.5 usually, but they say you should go half a size up in running trainers. So that's what I did. And these are the ones I'm keeping. 
time for my ginger and turmeric shot and then I'm gonna make a little smoothie and then get ready for my run. Uh, but this reminds me that you need to feel your body before you train. Chen. I changed into my running outfit. Love it. To be a runner, you have to look like a runner. Guys, I just finished and I ran seven kilometers. Seven, it was supposed to be six, but I think because of the resting walking, it ended up being seven altogether. But seven? Oh my gosh. I never thought I would be able to do that. But I'm feeling good. I'm not gonna lie, towards the end, I was like, fuck's sake, I still got two kilometers to go. I was like, oh my God, I'm so tired. But feeling good, feeling really energized. And I actually, understand what people say about runners like hi because i feel like i'm so happy right now um what i ran seven kilometers that is insane guys So guys, I just made some oats and excuse the state of it, I already started eating, but I added in some cacao powder, which helps with magnesium and really helps with fighting curves, fighting your PMS symptoms and all of that. I'm gonna finish my oats and then I'm gonna head off to the gym for a bit of a lower body session. Nothing crazy, we're just gonna focus on a bit of quads. Um, and yeah, that's my plan for the rest of the day. So guys, just got home and I ate, showered, and I'm just literally snacking on some raspberries, you know. I'm gonna make a hot chocolate and then go to bed. I'm planning on doing a really early morning session tomorrow. 6 a.m. Hopefully, I'll see you there. so today has been a day um i've been so busy with work personal training and work content creating i had to take my dog to the vet it was just so busy that i completely forgot to record the rest of the day but nothing happened apart from just working taking my dog to the vet and that's it i'm off to sleep now i'm just literally watching some gossip girl um i'm literally on the last two episodes uh i love it i hope you guys enjoyed spending this week with me i really enjoyed filming this so let me know in the comments if you enjoyed it please like subscribe and follow me for more i'll see you in the next one